Hello again and welcome back to The Body Coach TV. This is another 10 minute, gentle, low impact seniors workout. Nice and easy to get you moving, get you active, pick up your energy and get you feeling fantastic for the rest of the day. Now there's 10 exercises. We're gonna do 40 seconds on each exercise, followed by 20 second rest. I'll demonstrate the move, I'll explain what we're gonna do and you can just hopefully follow along and if, if any feel too difficult or you don't like them, just swap them for something else or skip it out completely and then rejoin for the next exercise. So the first thing I'm going to do is a really great way just to open up our hips. So we're going to take our knee up and out and draw sort of a big circle. So it's a balance exercise too for the standing leg. Just, you, if you can't lift the knee right up, just lift it gently and out. Okay, just think about opening that joint. Let's go. So start with the low knee, just round and out. So draw in a circle of that knee. And if you can, start to lift a bit higher each time. So lifting up. Again, this, this joint is a ball and socket. So we've got to take it through its range of motion but also developing strength with all those ligaments and muscles around that joint. So we're trying to lift it and control it as we come out. Lift it, control it, come out, good, and repeat that. Last few seconds, about 15 to go. So this is a 10 minute workout, very short, every exercise is different. And we're gonna do 40 seconds on each move, followed by 20 second rest. Right, last couple of seconds, and relax, perfect. That's one, work, one exercise complete. Next one I'm gonna do, we're gonna do a wide stance like this, and what we're gonna try and do now, taking our left hand, we're just gonna bend this knee and just touch that toe look. Okay, so it's like a toe touch. If you can't quite touch the toe, you can touch the knee or the shin, but the aim here is just to do left hand to right toe. So left to right, stand up, toe touch, stand up. Toe touch, good, so you're gonna be obviously working these quads, your hamstrings, your glutes are activating as well, so just touch those toes, stand up straight. Touch the toe, and then we'll switch to the other side at 40 seconds. So touching the toes, slight bend in that right leg. So you're having to bend this right leg, touch the toes. You'll feel a stretch from the inside of this leg too, so you're stretching muscles while also strengthening the others. Right, last 10 seconds. So touch, stand, toe touch, stand. Last five seconds, you're doing great. Three, two, one, and relax. Stay there with those feet, so it's not super narrow. Not super, super wide, so I can't just sort of, just beyond the shoulder width apart. And from here now, the right hand is gonna come down and touch that left toe, so it's, uh, sorry, right hand, left toe, stand up. So touch, stand up. Again, we're gonna feel a stretch with the inside of this leg, bend this left knee, off we go. So left toe, touch, stand, touch, stand. Perfect, you're doing great. This is an awesome exercise, this one. You're gonna feel a lot of stretching going on. But try and bend this leg a little bit, so you're not just bending from the hips like this and leaning over. You're actually bending this knee, so you're putting a bit of strength through this left leg. Good work. Come on, let's go. Touch that toe. Stand up tall. 15 seconds to go, guys. It's amazing that you're doing this. You turned up. You committed to it. You want to pick up your energy. You want to get fitter and stronger. I love that. I respect that. And I'm here for you because I love nothing more than getting people fit, at whatever age you are. And rest. Perfect. Right. That is three moves complete. Next thing I'm gonna do is get the arms out nice and straight like this. And the aim here is to try and bring our knees up to our elbows or as high as we can. So it's like a march on the spot and we're trying to bring those knees up, yeah? So try not to drop them down, keep them high. Let's go left, right. Right, so we're going left, right. If you're nowhere near those elbows, it's fine. You could be really low down here. Just keep the arms out straight, because you're balancing as well. You're having to balance. If you've done this for a while, we haven't done this exercise before, you're gonna feel that leg, standing leg, it's a bit wobbly, but you're gonna build that strength. So lift, and after a few weeks of coming back to this workout, you'll be lifting your knees higher, your hips will be open, and the muscles in your thighs and quads are gonna be strong, and you can drive those knees up. Last few seconds on this one. Five, four, three, two, one, and relax, amazing. Remember this, right? Regardless of your age or fitness level, you can always, always get stronger. There's always a way of just building that strength, fitness, you know, moving your body, improving your posture. So just keep coming back, keep pressing play, do a workout, keep it regular. Your body's gonna feel better, you're gonna help yourself get out of pain, and you can feel good. Right, so next thing I'm gonna do is a bit of a curtsy lunge. So you're basically stepping back and across the body. So you don't have to, but you're trying to drop the back knee right down there. Imagine we're doing a curtsy to the queen. So you drop down, so you're stepping back. But of course, if that's too difficult, 
Just step the foot really, look, you really haven't even got to bend the front leg, right? You can just step. But if you want to make it tougher, that's when you start to bend that front leg a bit more. So you drop that back knee, you bend the front leg. It's a slow exercise, quite a little bit, a little twisting. It's, it's obviously challenging on the knees, so just go as low as you can, go where you're comfortable. Stepping back, feet together, step back, feet together, perfect, right. So next thing I'm gonna do, standing up like this, we're basically gonna step up, we're gonna go knee, knee, one, two, three, four. So it's right knee, left knee, left, right, left, right, yeah? So right knee, left knee, four punches, here we go. So it's right knee, left knee, left, right, left, right. Right knee, left knee, left, right, left, right. One, two, one, two, three, four. One, two, one, two, three, four. Obviously you might not get those knees right up, but just make sure those punches are nice and long and just lift in, lift in. One, two, three, four. 15 seconds. And then eventually you'll be able to have the strength to bring that knee right up. And you'll be driving it up as high as you can. You'll feel this activating your actual obliques and your muscles and your abs as well. So it's great to get that knee up high and long punches. And that's it, that's six moves complete. Next thing I'm gonna do is basically, we're gonna do like a, imagine you're holding a weight in your hands and we're just gonna drop down to the side and using the obliques of these muscles in the side of your abs, we're gonna pull ourselves back up. So we go left, back up. Down, so trying to sort of drop this fist down to your knee. So feel a stretch, come up to the centre, stretch, up to the centre, good. So a little bit of movement through the spine and these muscles here, these oblique muscles that work with our posture and our core strength are going to strengthen up. So it's dropping down, dropping down, squeeze yourself, pull in with the opposite direction, you're going to feel here as you pull, yeah? So stretch together, trying to sort of brush that hand down towards your knee, 15 seconds to go. So stretch, pull, stretch, pull. Good, last few seconds, you did awesome. Last couple of exercises to go, twist, down, up, and relax, you should feel that through the sides there, brilliant. Okay, that's seven complete. Number eight, what we're gonna try and do now, this is quite a challenge, I'm gonna step back like this, and twist, so feet together. So we step left leg back, and you twist out towards the right leg, yeah? Then you go right leg back, twist towards the left. So a lot of balance, so step the right leg back, twist left, step the left leg back, twist right. Okay, so let's start right now. So right leg back, twist slightly to the left, Feet together, left leg back, twist out to the right. So twisting out to the right, the um, side of your knees on you. So twist towards the knee, twist towards the bent knee. That's it. So it's challenging our core, left and right. You don't have to go right down. Obviously, I'm trying to bend that back knee and get really a big bend in this front leg, and it's obviously much harder. But if you can't, step slightly, twist, step gently back, twist. Last few seconds. Just stepping, twist, last one, and twist. Excellent, right, final two exercises. That was a bit of a challenging one. We're gonna do two star jumps. So we're kind of gonna do like a, a kind of um, scaled down version. So we're not gonna jump into it, we're gonna step to step, step, and then we're gonna go reverse lunge curl, reverse lunge curl, yeah? So step, step, we step back curl, step back curl, yeah? So it's step, Step, step back curl. We're sort of reverse curl, reverse lunging whilst doing a kind of bicep curl. So we curl the arms back, curl the arms and back. Repeat. One, two, one, two. Excellent. One, two, one, two. Awesome. Keep going. One, two, one, two. We're doing it. We're doing great. Almost there. One. Last one. Two. Step and step. Brilliant. So a little bit more coordination. It's, it's also good for the mind. It's movement, you know, it's, it's our coordination, our balance. It's brilliant. So nice challenges, different workouts, different exercises to really get you moving, feeling good, and you know, just improving all of everything, your whole mind and body. Last exercise, we're gonna do a squat pulse. What that means is we're just gonna pulse. So just come down nice and low and pulse. Off we go. This is the last exercise. So just pulsing. So we're not going down and coming right up. Get the bend and just stay in that lower position. So the tension's on the quads, and now we're pulsing, just staying low in that position. 
So just gently, you can do it slow if you want, but you'll feel these legs working. So don't let the knees bend in, keep the knees pushing out, feet flat on the floor, and we're just pulsing. We've got another 18 seconds to go. Okay, final exercise. Stay coming, strengthen these legs, strengthen your bum, your thighs, your quads. 10 seconds to go, keep pulsing, stay low, stay low, stay strong, and hold it for five, four, three, two, four. There we go, look. Legs got a good little fire up at the end, little burner. Great workout, guys. Thanks for joining me. Remember, there's loads of workouts on the channel for you. You can check out the seven day senior challenge. But this isn't just for seniors. You know, if you're a beginner, or you're first to fitness, or you're also coming back from an injury, it's just great to just move your body, just do something. Like, so 10 minutes a day is perfect. It's a great start. So thanks again. Hope you enjoyed today's workout. If you want to um, get, get see more of my workouts, hit subscribe, and then you'll be notified when the next workout gets posted so you won't miss it. Well done, I'll see you soon. Have a great day and take care.